What's going on, everybody? Calcan Metro with another showdown live. If you guys are enjoying, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to support. Now, today, uh, I was able to find a team from uh, Let's Go on Forms and then UU tier. So, I'm gonna take a quick look at the team. Uh, we have Life Orb, uh, Special Attack, and Lucario. Um, but I think this is Twilight's team. Uh, they did have Focus Blast over Aura Sphere, but I like Aura Sphere more. Um, in the in the thread, they said that um, Focus Blast was there for breaking through specific Pokemon, uh, just so you can nab some Okos. Let me see how Aura Sphere works. So I should, probably really should just have Focus Blast there and then change it up to see if I like it. But uh, I'll just see how it is from here. Uh, with Flyneum Z. Uh, Moltres, uh, Hurricane, Fire Blast, uh, Roost, and Agility. Now, they said Agility was there because why not? Really wasn't much else to put on uh, Moltres. And, like, late game, you can come in Agility up and try to get some damage off on things. Uh, I'm also not really sure what else uh, could really have. I guess, like, Hidden Power. Like, uh, maybe Toxic or will -Wisp, possibly. But I'm not too familiar with DU tier, so. Uh, Scarf Crocodile. Not really much to say here. I uh, got the Intimidate uh, just to lower the attack of uh, opposing threats. And then Choice Scarf um, just for speed. Here we have the Mega Altaria, which I thought was pretty interesting. Um, these EVs look all over the place, but they're for specific reasons. Um, like the like Body Slam is here over Hyper Voice uh, to ensure the 2 hit KO on uh, Calm Mind uh, Mega Latias. Um, so there's special EVs in, um, as you mean special attack, there's only four, but that's there to hit uh, things like, uh, Mega Steelix, Mega Agron a bit harder. Uh, the defense EVs are here, oh, defense EVs on the Rock Nature are here to ensure that after Stealth Rocks, you live a, um, a Choice Band Bullet Punch from Scizor. Um, and then the attack EVs are just kind of to ensure you deal with, uh, you know, Mega Latias, things like that a little bit more. And you, the special defense EVs are here to make sure that I can constantly check um, Hydreigon. And to ensure that from full, I can live a, um, a Z Corkscrew Crash uh, from said Hydreigon. Uh, I don't, I would assume that that's going off a of Flash Cannon uh, and not Iron Tail. I don't think it can learn Iron Tail, but if it can, sucks to be me, I guess, and I'd probably run into it. Uh, next up, we have Empoleon. It's going to be our Stealth Rocker and our Defogger. Um, I'm not really fond of having Stealth Rocker and Defogger on the same Pokemon, but, you know, it's whatever. Uh, we have Toxic to help wear things down and the Earthen Moveset Standard. And then here we have Serena. Uh, Lumberry over... I forgot what else they had initially, but um, they had... What was it? They had High Jump Kick or um, over Synthesis initially, but... With the rest of the team, you can pretty much deal with steel types uh, pretty handily uh, with this. Um, I guess with this too to some extent, but more so uh, Files are. Oh, I'm sorry, uh, Moltres, that's what I nicknamed it. Um, the speed EVs are here to ensure you outspeed base 70 Pokemon such as uh, Bisharp. Um, but you don't have high jump kick, so I guess you just U-turn out. And uh, it also ensures you get a slow U-turn off versus um, other Serena. So after that, you could bring in um you can bring in like what's the pokemon altaria or um or moltres or, or even lucario um now they have power whip over over trap kick uh power whip is probably there just because they're more a bit more offensive and to, again ensure ko's uh, i'll see how this works i didn't swap this out for um trap kick but uh hopefully things go well and uh let's get a battle Okay, so um, we're here. Uh, unfortunately, we see um, Amamola in the first battle, which really sucks because that is actually uh, one of the Pokemon that um, that Lucario had uh, Focus Blast for. Uh, I'm going to lead with Crocodile here. Um, what I was honestly expecting was... Um, was Beedrill to get the Mega Evolution off? I think I still have Speed Beedrill, and I do. Um, unfortunately, I can go for Earthquake here. Um, I think Knock would be a fine play as well. Um, he's probably just trying to get up rocks and then just, like, suicide this out. Um, but I'm gonna Knock. 
Um, Noxia two hit KO. Taunts me. Uh, again, I'm Scarf, so that's fine. Uh, actually, I'm not sure if Noc, Noc won't two hit KO anymore. Um, but I have nothing to worry about in terms of in terms of uh, it doing damage because one of the Intimidate and two Lycanroc like doesn't have the best move set. Um, I, again, like I could want for Earthquake, but the reason I didn't was because I well I probably should have. It's Focus Ash, but uh, I opted to go for Knock, uh, and, and the off chance he's out to switch on to like uh, Almol or something like that. As regardless, uh, like I said, this isn't doing much to Crocodile anyway. So uh, there is that. Um, he knows I'm Scarf Crook. Uh, that means I outspeed his Zero Aura and his Beedrill, so it's going to be imperative that I keep this healthy. So I m might. Would it be in my best interest to switch out right now? No. Okay. So, they gave me the Rocky Helmet on the Alamola, which is pretty good, I'd say. Um, I'm going to go over to Penguin Mon here, because this will get me a free Toxic. Um, I Actually, now I want to Scald, uh, because I feel like I'm going to try to go into the Lycan Rock Dusk, and I don't want that happening, so I'm just going to Scald. Uh, I really want my rocks there, but... That it wasn't worth it. Like, that was... <laughs> that play was really obvious. Now, what I think they should have done is stayed with Alamola. Because worst case scenario, I get scald off on that. There wasn't really any reason for me to go for my rocks there directly. Well, there is because of the Beedrill. Um, wanting to come in all the time. Like, it seems like his team... His team is fairly frail. Uh, well, the, the offensive threats are fairly frail. Um, you have Sizzle... No, you have uh, Suicune with the bulk. And um, Alamola... They're being bulky. Scizor has bulk as well, but I don't know if it's like Fizz Def. So probably Choice Ban. I think Choice Ban's the most uh, most common Scizor set here. And uh, they just forfeit after that, which... I don't know, that didn't really seem like the optimal thing for them to do. Because if I did go for a Scald, like that... You're like, your rock just dies. Like, it seemed like the most obvious play in the world. So, oh boy. Okay, so another reason why we have those Spadef EVs on... Uh, the Mega Altaria is to live a uh, sludge wave from uh, Nihiligo. Uh Again, here, I'm thinking... Hmm. Maybe there's lead Crook? Because, wait, you could leave a Pidgeot, actually. Yeah, I'm lead Crook, because I could just switch into Empoleon. Um, if I had Stone Edge right here, I would 100... Hmm. Because if you Mega Evolve, you, uh... Hmm, doesn't kill. Okay. After Rocks, though, it does. There's one for the Raw Hurricane, too. Does that even kill me? Hurricane didn't even kill me. Hi, Jolly. Yeah. Um, I'm just going to rock up here. Probably go into Mana Buzz, so I should probably Toxic. If it goes into Mana Buzz, oh my god, that's big Terrakion. Uh, hmm. Uh... This is bad. I'm gonna go Serena. Ooh, is that banded? Oh, sorry. Uh, uh. Mm. Nope, banded would have killed me. Uh, do I need this for anything? Now I can go over here, though. See, so I've had this Mega Evolved when I wanted it to be Mega Evolved. That would have been great. Um, I can just go for Body Slam. You go Amoongus. Can I Fire Blast and two hit KO? I got a crit. Alright, I need to see. Oh. 
Altaria. Fire Blast. Spore is really free now too though. This is my most expendable thing to Spore. Now my question is, do they run HP Fire down here though? Maybe Double Powder? Ooh, in the hell we go. Uh, 335. Ouch. Earth power. I think I lose. I played this really poorly, I think. Um. Hmm. Rock poison. Does this thing learn earth power? I think it does, right? I'll go over here. Because I think I can take one hit. Uh, oh, please wake up. Oh, I'm not going to wake up. Never lucky. Um, so something dies. Actually. I go here now because I'm Mega Evolved now. I don't think you have Iron Head. Yeah, that did nothing. Uh, I'm gonna Fire Blast this time. Mmm. <sighs> that really sucks. But. I don't think it mattered all that much in the long run. Uh, oh, come on. All right, I wake up next turn, guaranteed. He can spore me again, though, which sucks. Can I please just thank you? Because now I have to defog. Can you scarf track actually? Mm, I don't like that. We have to roost here. I'm close enough to full. Eighty seven max. Uh, I'm going to risk it. Yeah. My Empoleon still sleeping? It is not sleeping. <laughs> um, I need to see. Terrakion. Uh, I think it's Scarf Terrak. do this. Uh, is that life orb? Ugh. It's not enough. See, I can get damage on it, right? But do I need Lucario to break anything? If I get 50% on that. I'm just going to go into Palumu. Like, I'm just going to have to get poisoned. 
It's almost out of close combat, so, so that's something. On the bright side, I can, uh... Hmm. I definitely take it. <laughs> I mean, I guess! <laughs> Oh, God. <sighs> All right. I guess so. <sighs> well, now I definitely think I lose. Um. All right, hold on. Uh, now I just have to connect my attacks, and I think I'm okay. Uh, this is more accurate. Terrakian comes out. I'm definitely popping a flying EMZ. That's a Hydragon. Uh, well, I lost my main answer to you. Do you live? Do you live? I don't think so. Yeah. Mm. Get some damage off. So I live that. I can roost it off. Cool. It's actually kind of what I wanted there. Um, so now let's foul play be doing a bit less. Uh, if I connect... Hmm, 34, huh? Well, he has to connect. So... Uh, Alright, so luckily, the crit didn't... End up mattering all that much. Um, it did in the sense that I lost a Pokemon from it, but that's fine. Uh, it put me in a really bad position, which is why I got kind of upset. I was like, okay, I can easily live uh, this Hurricane, but uh, obviously he crit me and I was poisoned, so I died at the end of that turn. Um, wait, what did I even die to? Did I die to something I would have been able to roost on? Oh, I did a Pidgeot, right? Did 88, right? With the, with the crit, we've done 44 without. I mean, I got a Headphone Pidgeot, which was which was the important part, uh, because that hit meant that Pidgeot was just in range of basically anything else for my team. Um, is some kind of trick room? Do I just do I just lead with? Kind of want to lead with Falzar because I feel like Cobalion or probably on Mam oh no Mammoth Swine. Oh this team loses hard to Mammoth Swine actually. Mammoth Swine's really hard. Our break Okay, so I want you guys to take a moment and my opponent forfeited. But look at look at Mammoth Swine, look back at my team, then look back to the Mammoth Swine. I can't I can't easily beat Mammoth Swine. Um in the thread that was one of the Pokemon that uh they said um, it's a big problem for this team, and it is because now looking at the team, uh, I can intimidate it. But uh, look at this so we go crash, 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 not crash, uh, earthquake. Like, obviously, Lucario outspeeds, but I have to get it in in order to outspeed, you know. So, like, every time Mammoth Swan comes out, I have to attack a Pokemon basically. My opponent shouldn't have scooped. That, I was free. Oh my gosh. I don't want to deal with this. Um, again, I think Crocodile is my lead here. Because what, either... I think one of these three as a lead. Why? Why have you done this? You just knock. Can I Earthquake? I'm gonna knock. 
Really? That was your play of choice? For the... Okay. Um, I'm gonna get my rocks up then. Use your soft boiled here. Are oh, you gonna toxic me? Okay. Uh. Hmm. This invites in zero aura. Should I just get my rocks up or should I defog? It's scald. I'm gonna defog. No. Uh. I'm gonna defog. I really want my rocks up. What I was thinking about doing was getting my rocks up on Blissey, hoping he would stay in, but you get Focus Blast. I do not have a switch in for you, really. Uh, I think I'll live one. I want my rocks up. I'll go for Air Slash. I'm toxic you. Do you not have Focus Blast? What are you? Can you air slash boomers roost taunt, maybe? What's going on? Like I know I'm on I I'm on a bit of the lower ladder right now, but I feel like You have Thunder Wave? Can you can you Thunder Wave? There's no way you're Thunder Wave. Um, oh, you're Scarf Lure. There's no way you're Scarf. Are you Scarf? Oh, I don't have Shadow Ball. Oh. Uh, hmm. Yeah, no, we out. I, I don't know why I thought I had Shadow Ball Flash Cannon as a superior option in most scenarios. Um, you're Sub Pain Slip, probably. Oh, you're Sub Call Mind. Oh, no. Actually, I should probably go hard crook, right? He's gonna sub up again here. Did not sub up. Do I connect? I do connect. Nice. Uh, okay, so. Can I still use this? See, without Mega Evolving, I don't have as much bulk. Do I need this for anything this game? I'm killing Mandibuzz, actually. You know what? I'm gonna go over here. No, I'm gonna let him pull in and I'm sack it. Yeah, because you just go Shadow Ball that turn instead of going anything else. Um, so now what I want to do is I want to go over here. Because now I know your entire set. And, uh... I think I just Body Slam, right? I'm just gonna Body Slam. You go, CMZ. I should live. I died. Huh. That's really, really sucked. I wanted that Pokemon there. Uh, I probably should have just got, gone into Crocodile. <laughs> Realistically. But... Oh my god. I thought I would have lived. Go, CMZ didn't even cross my mind. For things that can... Um, I think a Chandelier could... Neither did a Flame Body. <laughs> Okay. Well, this Pokemon's worthless now. Now you gotta go bee drill and do whatever you want with me because I'm bad at this video game. Oh my god. This really, really sucks. Um, Earthquake could still be useful. I could probably agility up on the Blissey or something. But I think I think I lost this game the instant I I sacked my Mega Altaria because after that I just started making a series of plays that were beyond bad. Um, actually, hold on. Twenty-five. Right, because either I set up on this or I set up on. On Mandibuzz. I'm gonna plot here. They'll probably stay in. Yeah. I really wanna go for Flash Cannon here, expecting the Noivern to come in, but I'm gonna plot again. 
30%. That'll give me three hits. I think this is fine. Let me see. Noivern. Let's put that set. Plus four. Uh, vacuum wave does not enough. So I'm at plus six. Plus six, I get three. No, I don't get plus, I don't get three. Mm. I'm just gonna Aura Sphere for the knockout here. Um, because he could miss Air Slash, I guess. Um, as a thing. Mandibuzz probably lives too, actually. I think I, play, I played this game so poorly, like, oh no, it doesn't. Yeah, plus... Four does not live. Zero. It's not like I have any other play, but pretty sure a vacuum wave knocks you out. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty sure Noivern lives, but if my opponent wants to not go Noivern, I'm more than okay with that because I'll have to. My opponent goes Noivern. I have to vacuum wave. It'll put about 50%. So that's about... Well, okay, so let's say 25, right? From Stealth Rocks. And, uh... uh this is my strongest option. So... Uh... Pretty sure Noivern lives. <laughs> um... Yeah, okay, so Noivern probably lives this. Um, which sucks, because this is such a weak move, but, yeah. Noivern con convincingly lives that. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't just go to Noivern first. I'm gonna go Crocodile. Uh, Knock will still hurt. I can go... We're at 51. I can go over here. Maybe I'll get the flame body. I don't know why my opponent sacked half of their Pokemon. Uh, I guess because I started playing bad. So they th they're just like, I can play bad too. I think you have the Swords Dance. No, you wouldn't be Swords Dance because I'm Scarfed. And a burn. Well, uh, my play is to Earthquake and hope it kills. Uh, if it does not, I lose. If it does kill, I win. So, I think it'll still kill. Beedrill has, like, negative 10 defense. But, yeah. I, I wasn't sure entirely if it would, uh, kill. I was fairly sure it would, but I was like, uh, there's off chance it might not without a burn, but... Sorry I'm calculating so much things. Like, I don't play UU, so, like, I don't know a lot of the calcs off the top of my head or approximately what they should do. And, uh, my opponent has a Sableye. Uh, ooh, Hippowdon, you say. I think I just want to lead Serena, right? Do I just lead Serena? I think I lead Serena. In case I lead Hippo. I think my opponent leads Hippo. Right? Yeah, you lead Hippo. Um, this doesn't have Toxic or anything. Uh, what if... Scizor, maybe, as your initial switch in? Oh, well, I guess I'll be back uh, once my opponent uh, gets back. Alright, so, my opponent never came back. Um, turn one, I was just going to U-turn out. Obviously, with Serena, it's not like I was going to hard switch. There's no reason to, because I had U-turn. But I U-turn out. Uh, I went into Muck, rather than going into uh, Scizor, for whatever reason. Uh, so, I just went into... Uh, Empoleon, I was going to get up my rocks and then play it by ear from there. I was expecting to get knocked off by uh, the muck, actually. Um, from there, I could, assuming you stayed in uh, on the rocks, I could start firing off skulls uh, because I can't get poison from Poison Touch. Like, I don't mind losing my item all that much, and I don't think I need um, Empoleon too, too much in this game. Uh, it serves as a, as a stopper for um, Sylveon can't just spam, like, Hyper Voice. I suppose maybe I'd want to actually want to keep it healthy, uh, but uh, we'll never know now because my opponent uh, Sacred DM just never came back. Then get one more, 
and uh, I'll be back once I get the last battle. All right, I am back, and uh, hmm, interesting looking team by my opponent. I cried on. Oh, uh, Crawdon, this is stopped by Crawdon as well. Have fun. What a nice guy. Um, as far as leads, uh, they have nothing to get rid of my hazards. Uh, Empoleon's gonna be a little bit dangerous because of the Magneton. So, getting up rocks is gonna be a bit difficult. I'm thinking maybe Magneton is elite. Either Magneton or this. Uh, I'm just gonna crook. Your entire team is physical. I might get a kill. I'm clicking Earthquake. There's no reason for me to not click Earthquake here, realistically. If you don't Mega Evolve, then you come close to dying. If you Mega Evolve, you might take like 40%. Because <laughs> Mega Agron has uh, huge defense along with uh, Filter. Uh, see, about 40%. Uh, toxic. Uh, I'll take that for 40% on Agron. Um... Where'd they go into? Heracross? I'm just gonna quake again. And keep this low. And uh, we'll just kill it here. Because that was one of the uh, the big things for my... Uh, my Mega Altaria. But also probably take a hit relative well for Moltres as well, being um, you know, being Mega Agron. Uh the Spideff doesn't I don't think he has that much Spideff, but uh the monster is here. Uh something's getting something's losing its item. And I don't know what it might be. Uh I'm gonna say you're banded. I'm gonna go for Crab Hammer. Ooh. Wait, why'd you go for Aqua Jet? I mean, I guess that's fine. He assumed I was Scarfed. Which I was. Uh, I'm gonna Rapid Spin here. Just don't go into Chandelure, please. Ooh, Chandelure's a good play for him. There's no reason not to, actually. Oh, Magneton instead. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um, Magneton's really slow. I think I take a hit from Magneton. Probably Analytic. I'm gonna U-turn. Uh, I'm do that. Well, this is in front of you. You don't go. Oh, that's interesting. But I get to pick one, buddy. Uh, do I just fly any here? I'm gonna hurricane. I'm gonna miss this hurricane and be super sick life. Oh, what if your scarf Hera? You give your scarf Hera. That's fine. Ooh, that's unfortunate. That really. Well. So that's for both of us. Um, I would be dead um, had his Stone Edge connected. Unfortunately, all right, I don't know what my opponent said. Um, I think, I think that's French. Maybe. I don't. I don't actually know. I'm gonna go over here to Penguin Mon. All right, my opponent missed again, which really, really sucks. Um, I think Magneton should come out for my opponent, so I kind of want to go back into Crocodile and click Earthquake. I'm going to do it. Oh, my opponent will Crawdon rather than Magneton. That's interesting. Really, really interesting. Wait, I said I'm trapped, and then I said Magnet Pull right after it. What's wrong with me? Or analytic. It can't be both. So because my opponent's not bringing in the Magneton, I'm assuming that my opponent is actually not. <clears throat> um, assuming my opponent is not. Not Magnet Pull. Uh, I can go into Lucario here. Um, no, I'm going to go here instead. I'm just going to body slam and hope that uh, you're not actually playing body on your... So actually, what's wrong with going Earthquake? I think Earthquake was actually the play. Uh, I could Quake here. 
Uh, but then I lose my uh, switch into Mega Heracross. I'm in a really bad spot, actually. Uh, well, you probably... No, you Flash Cannon here. I'm a Stealth Rock. Okay. So they're Eviolite. Light. That makes this a lot easier to deal with. Uh, I didn't try to see if I was trapped or not, though. So that's something to keep in mind. Uh, Crawdon could come back out here for my opponent. Uh, it's, we're getting pretty close to... Getting pretty close to uh, Earthquake just cleaning up this battle, though. Yeah, well, that's why I did that play. I'm gonna Earthquake this time. Catch a Magneton and switch in. Yep, yep. Goodbye, Magneton. Being at 75%, though. Poison Jab? Can you Poison Jab Actress? There's no other reason why you would. I can probably live, though. 75? I think I live. Oh, no! What are you doing? Oh, I guess he didn't know. I guess I didn't know about Pixelate. Oh, I don't know how common Mega Altaria is down here in lower tiers. Kind of like the team. Wait, hold on. Is this, which team is this one? This is from Twilight, yeah. Um, I don't know if I want to use this team again. I got, I like it, but having no Mamoswine switching is really, really rough. Because uh, Mamoswine actually outspeeds uh, a good majority of this team. A matter of fact, uh, two members on my team, outs or three members on my team outspeed it, but... It's just a matter of being able to get in and then being able to kill the Mammal Swine. Like, if they leave with Mammal Swine, I might just lose. I don't know. I like playing Yu Yu, though, in lower tiers in general. I know. A little bit of a refreshing change from OU. But yeah. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to share your support. Um, if you guys like to send me teams, you can do so by heading over to my Discord and dropping them in the RMT section. Uh, I check there often asking for teams, but a lot of times no one leaves me teams, so kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Later.